The High School Sports Insider rolls along. Thanks for riding shotgun with us. It was a cool story recently when the Caps traded for Larry Nance Jr. and the team announced they would allow Larry Jr. to wear his dad's number 22, which is retired in the rafters. Over at Revere, that number 22 belongs to a Nance as well. Pete Nance, another in the long line of outstanding basketball players in the Nance family who are also great people. The Ohio Lottery Partners in Education program is proud to salute Pete Nance from Revere High School, this week's Shining Star. Number 22 for Revere grabs your attention and makes you take notice. Need to break the press? Give it to 22. You need a basket inside? 22's the guy. The defense is daring you to take a jumper? Go to number 22. Need some defense? 22 is ready to block the shot. Number 22, Pete Nance, has pretty much a complete game. My strengths, I think I can get around the basket, um, make some good, some good around the basket shots, and then uh, once everybody starts cutting off, like I mentioned earlier in our offense, um, just easy passes right for layups. Um, I can step out and shoot the three if they start to push me around a little bit inside. Where do you start? You got a guy who's almost 6'10", and he plays all five spots for us, and uh, you know he can bring the ball up the floor, as you saw. He can post up. He can shoot a three off the dribble. He's got a mid-range game. Very unselfish. You know, super high basketball IQ, and, and that's the beauty of it is that you know he makes guys around around him better. That's the highest compliment a player can get, and with Nance, there's a good reason. He's grown up around the game. His father, Larry, was number 22 for the Cavs in the 80s and 90s, and his brother, Larry Jr., was recently acquired by the Cavs from the Lakers. So Pete has a unique perspective on basketball that he'll take with him to Northwestern next year. I love basketball, but one day the ball is going to stop bouncing. So Northwestern is a really good place where I can play high-level basketball but also get a really high-level education. Um, I'm thinking about communications, but I'm not 100% positive yet. Pete had dozens of scholarship offers from the likes of Ohio State, Purdue, Florida, West Virginia, Tennessee, and Clemson. He committed to Northwestern last June. It's just a really exciting place to be right now. Um, went down there for my visit and just absolutely fell in love with it. The people down there are just were super nice to me. Coach Collins and the coaching staff are really great people, and I think they have uh, they're building something really cool down in Evanston. So I'm excited. Nance affects the game all over the court. He can be an intimidating force inside and has a unique talent to block shots. Uh, it's just kind of timing, just waiting. Like, uh, kind of bait him into a layup and then just come over and clean it up once they, once they shoot it. He's one of the top players not only in Ohio, but in the country. And as talented as Pete Nance is, he's an even better teammate. He's a very likable kid. Um, you know, he, he's a kid you'd want to have as your own son. You know what I mean? Like, if my daughter brought home Pete Nance, I'd be thrilled. Not because it's Pete Nance, but because who he is. And, you know, he's a great kid. If you know a role model student like Pete, we want to hear about it. Go to OhioLottery.com, click on the Supporting Education tab, and nominate them as an academic all-star. They could end up featured on the High School Sports Insider as our next shining star.